Hi guys, this is Rich from Rich TV Live. We are 21 days, 13 hours, 34 minutes, and 32 seconds away from history. And there's a new stock that I've been looking at and I'm very interested in. And it's called MPX. And you can see all the top winners of the day. Take a look at JAGX. Wow, up 215%. It was dropped to us in our group chat. CEI up 39%. Alifia Health, A-L-E-F, up 22%. Canada House Wellness, one that I bought today, CHV up 22%. Tilray making a bounce back up 18%. PREV, one that I sold today, a big winner within our community, up 17%. EXX up 4%. IGX up 14%. ABIO up 14%. GBLX up 12%. NBEV up 11%. Just to name a few... And Aurora Cannabis today had big news and they went up early and I sold my position on Aurora Cannabis. It's true. And a lot of members did too. And it has come lower. It seems to be bouncing back a little bit now, coming back from a little bit of a rebound. But um, congratulations to anyone who took their profits. Buy on rumors, sell on news. That's exactly what I did today. Like a robot, no emotion. Very happy with my decision. Ended up picking up some new positions, including MPX. MPX is a company that I just picked up today and I want to show you guys why I picked it up. Okay, so I like to look for undervalued companies. This is one that I feel that falls under that category. Currently at 91 cents today. It doesn't trade a ton, isn't huge that everyone's talking about, doesn't have all the momentum, but it is a good company. I'm going to show you guys why I like MPX. Let's pull it up. Okay, guys, if you want to find these tools, you can go to www.richtvlive.com, hover over stocks. All the tools you need are right there, absolutely free. All the news you need is right there, absolutely free. You can find us and follow us on all social media platforms right there, absolutely free. And with only 21 days away from legalization, companies like MPX, I think, are positioned to explode. Now, remember, Risk TV Live is strictly for education, entertainment purposes. Always do your due diligence. Always do your research before you invest in anything that we talk about here on Rich TV Live. Just because I buy it or I'm talking about it doesn't mean you should invest in something because you love it, you did your research, and it's something that you really want to own. So MPX is currently the third highest revenue generator in all of Canada. It's true. Look at this. The third highest revenue generator behind Aurora Cannabis and Cannabis Growth in all of Canada and up 224% in the last year alone. That alone is staggering. You can see America. The only ones higher in America are True Leave, a brand new IPO today, which I brought to you guys, which generated $23 million in the quarter, which is enormous. And Charlotte's Web, another IPO, which I brought to you guys, which has generated $17.2 million in the quarter. There's only four companies making more money than MPX Bioceuticals, and all four of those companies are trading at $10 or more. MPX Bioceuticals, though, is trading at only 90 cents. <laughs> so today, your boy Rich bought some MPX, and I believe that this is a company that long-term could be a big winner. And I'm, I'm willing to wait on this one. This isn't one that I need to you know, see returns on right away. It's more of a long-term play for me. You can see Bar Chart has an 8% buy, and if we look at its long-term how it's done over the last year, you can see it's up 225% in the last year, 35% in the last three months, and 8% in the last month. So it hasn't really exploded like some of these other ones yet. I believe it will. I am getting in early on this. I only have 2,000 shares, but I do want to get up to 10,000 shares before it gets to a dollar, and I believe it will. And I believe it will soon, just basically based on its revenue, and now it's got some big news. Let's read it. So today, Toronto, September 25th, Globe Newswire, MPX Bioceutical Corporation, otherwise known as MPX or the company, on the CSE, the Canadian Securities Exchange, on the OTC, under the symbol MPXEF, announced that Beth Stavola, Chief Operating Officer of MPX, will be speaking at the Cannabis and the Capital Markets Panel at the Cannabis World Congress Business Expo, otherwise known as the CWCBE being held on Thursday, September 27th, 2018 at the Los Angeles Convention Center in downtown Los Angeles. Business opportunities in the cannabis industry are at an all-time high as the market is developing on a global level. There are still many layers 
to success in this industry, and one of its leading voices, Beth Stavola, will provide industry insights to the panel addressing the pitfalls, opportunities, and lessons learned from the process of going public as a cannabis company in the United States and Canada. The panel of speakers will be moderated by Louis Goldberg, managing partner of C. KCSA, Strategic Communications, and will include Chris P- Crane, President and Co-Founder, Forefront, Tahira Mamatula, Chief Financial Officer, MTech Acquisition Corp., and Managing Director, Hyperventures, William Simpson, CEO, Golden Leaf Holdings, which, another one which I just bought today, love me some Golden Leaf Holdings, on the CSE under the symbol GLH, on the OTCQB under the symbol GLDFF, and Beth Stafola, C-suite executives of leading cannabis companies who have recently gone public or are in the process of going public. Taking a company from private to public is already a very challenging process, let alone attempting to do so in the cannabis industry, says Miss Stavola. This panel considers all factors along the continuum of growing the industry and outlines strategies for effectively growing a cannabis company, providing a vital educational resource for entrepreneurs looking to enter the industry. Ms. Stavola, who entered the cannabis industry in 2012 as an investor, became Chief Operating Officer of MPX Corporation when they purchased her flourishing Arizona marijuana venture in January 2017. She is also the President of U.S. Operations for MPX. These are the event details. Thursday, September 27th, that is in two days, 2018, the Cannabis and Conventional Capital Markets at the Los Angeles. Angeles Convention Center, Conference Room 501 AB, Los Angeles, California at 12 p.m. PST. You can register for the event at www.cwcbexpo.com backslash Los hyphen Angeles slash 2018 slash schedule. Let's learn a little bit about MPX Bioceutical Corporation, a new company that your boy Rich bought today. MPX, through its wholly owned subsidiaries in the U.S., provides substantial management, staffing, procurement, advisory, financial, real estate, rental, logistics, and administrative services to three medicinal cannabis enterprises in Arizona operating under the Health for Life dispensaries and the award-winning Melting Point Extracts, high-margin, concentrate, wholesale brands. The successful Health for Life brand operates in the rapidly growing Phoenix Metropolitan Statistical Area. With the acquisition of the Holistic Center, MPX added another operating medical cannabis enterprise to its footprint in Arizona. Green Mart of Nevada NLV LLC, Green Mart NV, is an award-winning licensed cultivation, production, and wholesale business, licensed for both the medical and the adult use sectors in Las Vegas. Nevada and is already selling wholesale into the Nevada medical cannabis market. Green Mart Nevada has also optioned suitable locations and intends to enter the high margin retail arena by applying for at least two dispensary licenses in the Las Vegas market, which will operate under the Health for Life brand. In Massachusetts, MPX is building out and will operate a cultivation and production facility as well as up to three dispensaries and manages three full-service dispensaries and one producer in Maryland. In Canada, MPX has acquired Canvita, which has received its cultivation license from Health Canada, will operate a cultivation and production facility in Peterborough, Ontario. The company also leases a property in Owen Sound, Ontario, for which an application to Health Canada has been made for a cannabis production and sales license. In addition, the company will continue its efforts to develop its legacy nutraceuticals business. Now remember, past performance is not an indication of future results. We are not licensed advisors. I did buy shares of MPX today. I think long-term it's going to be a winner. It's a long-term hold for me. Let's see how it goes. I'll keep you guys updated. Please, if you like this video, smash the like button. Remember, if I win and you win, we all win. This is people helping people. Let's find the winners first, people. I really like this company. Let's take a look at some of the statistics. So there are 384 million shares. So it's quite a lot of shares. 
and total diluted 638 million shares. So there are a lot of shares out. That's one of the reasons why the stock is not at a higher price. But I believe based on their revenue, based on some of their key acquisitions, this is the type of company that has a lot of shares for a reason. And I believe that those shares are being utilized to acquire their growth, similar to a company like Aurora Cannabis that has a lot of shares out. And long term, they could be a very big player. So comment down below. Let me know what you think. We are literally like we are so close to history. 21 days, 13 hours, 23 minutes and 57 seconds away from history. This is your boy Rich bringing you the news MPX to participate in a panel at 2018 Cannabis World Congress Business Expo on Thursday. It's true. MPX in Canada. MPXEF in America. This is your boy Rich. If you're not winning, you're not watching. I'm out. Peace.